Um, I'm Steven, and I'm part of the Human Orchestra, Human Chimes uh, group. I'm Xavier, and I'm in charge of filming and editing. Okay, I'm mean when working on the Max Patch. I communicated with Steven as well as the other professors who are helping me with working with the patch. Using a rope, swimming pool noodles, and LED lights, we have created an effective prototype instrument. So the goal of our project is to create a collaborative sound installment that will allow two people to interact both with each other and our system. Each different colored light will affect a separate audio track. Um, there will be a webcam that will track color over uh, the X, Y, and Z planes. This is an example prototype with the lights attached to the instrument. We cut small parts out of the ends of the pool noodle as to insert the battery pack for the LED lights. The string lights will be fed through the pool noodle and wrapped around. This will provide for 360 coverage of light. Our tool will work best in the dark. Our instrument can either be used as one long pool noodle or connected at both ends to create a circle. The first patch we worked on was a patch received from Steven with his other class. This patch was already tracking the color blue, and as such, we decided to add on from there. Patches 2 to 3 focus on correcting the colors as well as figuring out which webcam would best capture the colors. We noticed that certain lighting would often influence the patch. We found the Logic Tech to be the best camera to use. Within patches 4 to 5, we used simple samples such as waveform, drums, and piano, all of which were tested with comb filter, low pass filter, and cycle filter. We realized that these filters caused too much distortion in which they would often overlap to move forward with Ableton. Ableton gave us more options and variety as to how we wanted to edit the sound and also within our final patch we managed to get all three colors tracking properly within one patch.